Hey, there you are. I've been looking all over for you. Come here. Give me a hug. I needed that. God, you're so soft and huggable. Mm. Hey, do you mind if we talk? No, it's nothing giant. It's just... <sighs> Let's just sit down. No, everything's fine. No, everything's fine. It's just you may need to sit for this next part. How have you been lately? You've been commenting on these videos. I hope you have. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I get it. Trying to balance out your life is tough, but I'm proud you're still trying. Don't feel bad if you need to take a break or a day to recharge. Hell, you're only human. Do I look nervous? Nah, I'm okay. It's just I need to talk to you about something kinda on the serious side. No, no, no. You didn't do anything wrong. I just need to get this out. I don't want you panicking or anything, okay? Just listen to what I have to say. This isn't going to be a bad thing. It's just a change, that's all. It might sound like a lot at first, but I promise this change is not as bad as it'll sound. In fact, it could be really good. If you landed your dream job, you wouldn't think of it as a bad thing. It would be a change from what you've been doing this whole time. I'm not stalling. <laughs> uh, okay, maybe a little. I just don't want to rush this and give you the wrong impression. We've been together for how long now? Yeah, that's a long time. I feel like those years just flew by. It feels like only yesterday I started this crazy journey with you. It feels like... It feels like only yesterday I started this crazy journey with you. But time moving quickly means we had fun, right? We've gotten up to so much craziness, adventure, and wild antics. Pretty sure we even broke a lot of the rules. <laughs> but... I don't think we need to tell anybody about that. It could be our little secret. Even the inside jokes we share is just the tip of the iceberg. We're such a good team, you and I. I don't... I don't want to break it up, but I think it is time for a change. We've been doing this for so long, and I wouldn't change any of the things we've done together. They... They will feel forever. They will forever be incredible memories inside my head. And I don't regret a thing. And I don't regret a thing. <sighs> but it's time to move on. I know this might seem like it's coming out of nowhere, but I've been thinking about it for a while now. I didn't want to bring it up before because it was just a fleeting thought. I didn't want to bother you with it. But I've given it a lot of thought, looked at all the angles, and I've decided that moving forward is the best for both of us. I promise, I haven't just thought about myself in this, so just listen. There's this other guy, and I think he'd be better for you. Link is in the description. I think you two would really hit it off. He's everything you're already into. And it would be wrong of me to hold you close when you're better off with someone else. With the new changes I'm going to be making in my life, I don't want to deprive you of anything that you need and anything you've gotten used to. We got so comfortable with our daily routine and patterns. I really don't want to disrupt that. 
Despite the fact that things are going to change. Despite the fact that things are going to change. And they... And they won't be exactly as they were before. I just really want you to be happy. You're the most precious thing in my life. Without you, I would never have what I have right now. Your unwavering support has meant the world to me. It's built me up when I fell down. It's helped me in my darkest of times. Those moments when I'm feeling low, when I feel I don't deserve anything that I have. Imposter syndrome hits hard, especially late night, when your brain is wide awake, not letting you sleep. Come here, little one. I know. I know change is scary. No one likes it. But, well, some people like it. And those people are weird. It kind of feels like a rug is being ripped from under you. It kind of feels like a rug is being ripped from under you when a change comes out of nowhere. But I definitely agree that you don't need an old rug under your feet. I think you can stand without it. And this new guy is going to take such good care of you. He's adored you for a long time. He's been waiting so patiently for you. And I know for a fact that his wait will be worth it when he finally gets to hold you in his arms. I know that's a fact. I've known the sweetest heaven in your arms. And I know he's been dying to be with you. He's going to love you. And you're going to love him. <laughs> I know this is a lot. I know you're going to miss me. But I know this is going to be so much better for us. Will I miss you? Of course. I'm going to miss the hell out of you. But it's not like we won't see each other again. Oh, you'll definitely see me all right. I might just seem a little different. Might paint my hair black, look a little different, and I might be trying some new things. But it's still me, and the only reason I'm able to make this step is because of your constant love. This won't be a bad change. This would be the best change. Keep one eye on me, and watch as I grow and get better. Because my success is only going to grow, I'm going to get better, more creative, and work harder. There are good things ahead, and I want you to watch it as it unfolds. Yeah, I promise the other guy will treat you right. I would never entrust you in hands that couldn't take care of you, or someone who can't give you what you need. We both know you have a lot of desires. We both know you have a lot of desires and interests, and he's more than happy to accommodate them. He's excited to meet you. I might not be able to promise that he'll be gentle with you, but you never shed away from that sort of thing before. I just wanted one last kiss. One last taste. I know it's selfish of me, but I needed it. And I have a feeling you needed it too. Remember, this isn't the end. And changes can be... selfish sometimes. <laughs> <laughs>